You ever get exhausted? I bet you do. Let's talk about it. Tesla therapy as always. My name is William D. Bacari. You can find me on Twitter at The Agitated Rock. You can find All of Us Studios content on different social media platforms at All of Us Studios on Twitter, YouTube, Instagram. We also live stream every single week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Fridays, twitch.tv slash All of Us Studios. Come check us out. We have awesome gaming content and podcast content for you guys that touches on all of our positivity that we'd like to share with you guys. So today, Guys, we're gonna talk about exhaustion, burning the candle at both ends, you know, just how it takes a toll on your body, how it affects you mentally, how it affects you physically, and I'm gonna share some of the, I guess, trials and tribulations and instances that I've had, and I wanna share them with you today regarding just pure exhaustion. Um, as you guys probably know, if you've watched some of the Tesla therapy videos from before, I. Uh, I try to fill up my schedule pretty, pretty plentiful. Um, I have worked in customer service, like I was saying, for basically my entire life. And also on top of that as well, too, as you guys know, I create content. So it's definitely a burning a candle at both ends situation. I'm married. I've been married since 2016 to my lovely wife, Grace. And so all of that has to play into your life. All of it has to play into time management. And I think that's the key phrase for exhaustion here today, guys. If there's one phrase that I want you to go home with and think about and contemplate is time management. I believe that the older you get, the more experiences that you have in life and the more things that you can attribute to success and failure, all result in time management. How could you have managed your time either better or did you manage your time really well and you gave yourself extra leeway to be able to relax or decompress at the end of the day or the week or the month or the year? However your work schedule works, however your ebbs and flows go out through the day, are you giving yourself enough time? Are you managing your time? And I know for me personally at 31 years old, that's only gotten better and better. Now, on the flip side of that coin, it's tough. I'm not going to sit here like always and tell you guys that things are easy. That's not true. That's not what this channel is about. It's about self-reflection. It's about looking inward and being your best self, but also knowing what tools you have and acquired throughout your history as a human being to utilize those tools and put those tools in practice to make yourself feel better, act better, and just be better in public in general, and just to have better mental health, have better physical health. All of these things come down to time management, especially when you're dealing with exhaustion. I know for me personally, um, you know, just last weekend, we had three live streams in one day. Now, that's not terribly difficult, but with a two-man operation and no real support outside of that, so to speak, other than our community and the people who support and love us, obviously, that's not what I'm saying but I'm talking about a hands-on person or people or a team helping out and seamlessly integrating things together and firing cues and making sure our audio is correct and making sure shots are right, making sure our green screen is chroma keyed in properly. All of those things Brian and I make happen behind the scenes. And then we also get on camera and talk about different topics, different things, our podcasts, whatever it may be. So what I'm saying here, guys, is being able to time manage something like three live streams in a single day is exhausting when you only have two people. There's no excuses. I loved it. I loved every single minute of it. As a matter of fact, when I was tired at the end of the day, it's 12, 31 o'clock in the morning, go back upstairs, try to lay down for a little bit. I was buzzing. I was so ecstatic and so happy and so, you know, uplifted and on such a high at that point that it was hard to go to bed. We had just created a bunch of content and we were living that moment. We were living in that moment. And so that's where that exhaustion starts to catch up with you and you have to take care of yourself and you have to know that you are overexerting yourself to a certain point. 
So, like I said, time management, be aware of exhaustion, and understand that these things are real and they affect you positively and negatively. So try to do your best to go ahead and use it in a positive light, as we always say on this channel, and be your best person. As always, thank you so much, and we'll see you next time.